college kids taking out loans will see their interest rates go up this fall. And financial aid advisors at Middle Georgia State College say they're ready to help concerned students. 41 NBC Skylar Henry went to campus to get their take and also see how this will impact future enrollment. St student loan interest rates were at 3.4%. On July 1st, that number doubled. Middle Georgia State College is one of thousands where students are impacted and the school is gearing up to do something about it. During college summer vacations, students are usually headed back home or hanging out with friends. Some like Raven Kind are in summer school trying to get ahead. Raven is one of hundreds of thousands of college students who take out loans each year. On July 1st, Congress didn't meet the deadline to keep interest rates at 3.4 percent, causing the rates to double. Kind of makes me feel sad because people really do want to go out, go to school and they can't afford it right now. So they get student loans to help them afford it. New numbers came out in a USA Today article that shows 265 colleges and universities had a percentage of borrowers who started paying loans in 2009 but defaulted by 2012. Those numbers were higher than the school's graduation rates. The two schools that formed Middle Georgia State College, Macon State and Middle Georgia College are both on that list. Since they merged, Director of Financial Aid Patricia Simmons says those numbers have improved. Since then, our graduation rate has tremendously increased. One of the other things that we are uh, going to be working with as far as the students is concerned is making sure that the students know that there is options out there instead of defaulting. Options like adjusting loan payments depending on the borrower's salary. While Simmons says the numbers in the article are accurate, she expects them to change. Dr. Marty Venn, who is our vice president for academic affairs, said this morning that our completion rate is more like a 28 percent rather than the, the uh, numbers that was reported in the uh, article. Mm -hmm. Simmons says Middle Georgia State College is trying to identify categories of students who default more than others so they can try and help. She says the school is aiming to create a financial literacy course to help students when they go out into the real world.